at Lagos Airport as 250 cows arrive Nigeria from the United States. About 250 cows arrive at the Mutala Mohammed International Airport in Lagos State from New Jersey, United States of America. The cow were imported by Ekiti State government in a partnership with a private organization for their dairy farm in Ikun. About $5 million was invested by the state government and the private organization into dairy farm. The special assistant to President Mohammed Buhari on digital and new media, Tolu Ogun Lesi, confirmed this on his Twitter handle on Thursday morning. The cows were flown into Nigeria in crates. One crate got damaged and the ground staff didn't secure the cows after offloading. The drama occurred when the cow started running and chasing staff at the airport tarmac. It took the intervention of some strong men to manage the situation. As productivity and revenue increase, Ikun Dairy Farm will create hundreds of jobs directly and indirectly and also improve the economy of Ikun Ekiti, the host community surrounding community and Ekit State at large. Well, in fact, sometimes the situation of Nigerian will confuse you. You won't know what to say again. Because right now, uh, most of the situation in Nigeria that cause crises, which make Nigeria environment unsettled, for people to do hell are uh, full any headsmen. They are using their cows to graze from the northern part of Nigeria to the southern east or southern west. So this is what is causing problem generally in Nigeria. As full any headsmen has gone to people's farm, kill the owners of the farm, destroy farms and what have you. And as a result, there is a great inflation and famine right now in Nigeria. Now, I am surprising to hear that or to see that the state government has imported 250 cows into the state for dairy farm. Now, if I may ask the question, although I do not know how they have prepared, but I want to say here that I believe they have constructed ranch where they would keep the cow because if they started rearing the cow and started moving about just as the flanny men i mean flanny headsmen are doing it will cause another problems entirely and right now i believe this will not give an opportunity to the flanny headsmen to begin to load their own cows from the northern part of Nigeria to the eastern part of Nigeria and cause havoc again. So, cow is the one causing problems in Nigeria. I wonder why the state government now see as the best time to, 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 to introduce this system into the state. Is it the best time? I, I, I believe that, they, I don't know their, their plan. I don't know their plan, but in my own opinion, this is not the best time to would have bought such a cow and bring them into Nigeria for rearing. Now, instead of the state government to involve himself in this business, what if he tried to send some indigenous, I mean, people from the Ekiti state? to go abroad and learn farming system. Would that not be better? Because I believe that what you have in your brain, that is what you will put into practice. But buying 250 cows from the United States to Nigeria, I hope he has men enough on ground to be able to take care of the cow. So I don't know, Nigeria is a confusing country so to speak.
It's a confusing country. So chaos is the one causing problem everywhere, and people are trying to avoid it. I, I believe in the Ekiti state itself are trying to chase us full and amen from their land because they are destroying farms and, 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 and the environment. I wonder why. So what I, I would say, ask this question again. I hope the Ekiti state government has prepared well. They have constructed where they are going to reel the cow without causing problem from one state to another. Because very soon, I, 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 the neighboring state will start reporting that Ekiti state has done this, has done that. And this is where we give an immense power now to begin to, 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 to advance into their state. Uh, yes, okay, if them have, if they have cow, I believe we can bring our own too. Nobody can stop us. Okay, if Kawo is not a good business, why should the whole state involve himself in such a system? So, I do not know. I do not know. We are talking of Kawo not allowed into a state, and then the government is abusing, investing $5 million in bringing Kawo into Nigeria. Wow, what a country are we? What are we going to say about this country? What are we going to liken this country with? What kind of men are ruling us in Nigeria? Where do they come from? Are they born of a woman? I do not know. How are they risen? It's just like... Uh, 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 um, it's, it's just like B is stinging everybody. And people are trying to avoid B. And then someone will not go and, and, uh, uh, and in, invite B into the midst of the people. And the people, they'll begin to look at that person. What kind of human being? Are you human being at all? We are trying to drive this thing out of our, uh, of our environment. And now you now bring more. Are you trying to harm us? So they will call that person an evil person. So I don't know what, I don't, I don't know what to say. So for this reason, I think the state government are not bringing more problem into Nigeria let them look at this situation very well let them know how to manage it if not i see this situation bringing another problem